You watch one horseshoeing video on YouTube and it up your recommendations so bad. Well, you know what's weird is you can watch like one creator 900 times and YouTube won't push them to your like recommended. And you watch like <laughs> one clip of something, something completely random that you don't want because of a clickbait title. And it's like you're stuck with that forever. Uh oh, that's not good. Oh, that was great. Uh, Navita Sien. What? Oh, I can't. I mean, I guess I just can't. Oh, uh, I didn't even mean to do that. I was just trying to hit that one. Really? <laughs> Uno mas, I'm stumped. I don't think that was that hard. No! No! Not even close. Gosh, not even close. Ah, turbo controller. Cute, cute level. Oh, I thought that was it. No! Oh! oh. You heard me talking about a pet turtle in one video? Do I still have my pet turtle? Yeah, we'll have our pet turtle forever. He lives in uh, an over a bit of an oversized tank in between two giant plants. So most people don't even realize he is in our house. That are here for a day or two. Um, he is a happy turtle. He is a boy. We originally thought he was a girl, and then we learned later on he was a boy. So he was Brienne of Turd. Then we just renamed him Turd of Garth. Constantly getting a little bit bigger. Always. Cute little turtle. I hate him. No! Why? No! 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 Fuck! Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, we got a good... We were off the jump on that one, chat. We hit him right out of the blocks. I mean, I was... Re oh god! Fucker put on DRS. On, off, where'd you go? Uh... Fuck this game. So an ending is gonna be both good and bad. Why did I do that? Why did I turn around right there? I quit. I, I, that was the dumbest death I've ever taken. Guys who don't wash their butts in the shower because they're worried it's... No, that, that's not true. I don't believe that one. There's a whole thread of, uh, on Reddit about women calling out their exes for doing the same things. Their exes? What are you What are you girls doing dating these humans? Hard to know about shower habits before the first date? Okay, well, at some point, at some point, you're going to realize it, right? And that's not a deal breaker for you? Obviously, that's not the thing that broke the deal with them, though, because obviously they tried to get them to change it. How do you have that conversation with someone? Hey, honey, I'm going to need you to start washing your ass. Just like that. You thought there was no kink shaming? That's not a kink shame. I don't think it's a kink to have a gross to not wash your butt. It's not a kink. It's the opposite of a kink. A kink would be you wash your butt too much. There's a large percent of men that won't use lotion. I get that. I, I know that. I don't get why. Like, I didn't, but I didn't start using lotion until I was, you know, like a teenager or something. 
And uh, and it was only because I had like chronically dry skin. Like it was really bad. Is there a white person equivalent of Ashy? That's what I, I mean, I was Ashy. And thankfully I was in a multi-racial home at that point. So they knew what to do. Your wife forces lotion on you? How does she need to force it on you? Don't you feel better when you have not crusty skin? Don't you like being able to pick up a piece of paper and not send a chill up and down your spine? I gotta keep my hands nice and soft, you know? Helps the gameplay. One of our friends, he's like, oh, I'm worried the vaccine's gonna cause me to not be able to have babies. And I'm like, no, your personality's gonna cause that. But anyway, I've seen that girl do blow from a stranger at a festival. I think we well, you're clearly dumb. The peer-reviewed articles that are quoted, quoted inside, no, fuck! Was I a little shit? Uh, no, I wasn't like a little shit. I definitely, uh, I, what do I want to say? I knew from a pretty young age that the world wasn't like I was being taught all the time. So I was very, probably very challenging. I also knew from a really young age that I didn't want to be like, like, uh, I didn't want to have a job where I wore a suit, you know what I mean? Like, I didn't want to work in, like, an office or anything like that. So I think that was frustrating for a lot of people around me. And I also was a pretty good talker. It was very easy for me to make a lot of the adults around me stumble when they were challenged on topic. I guess, and I took advantage of that. But yeah, maybe I was a little shit. Yeah, hindsight, I was a little shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was a little shit. Yeah. No, it, you know what? It wasn't that... You know what it was? I, I had, like, this, like, weird resentment against my family at, a, like, kind of a young age. Um, I didn't like, like, some of the things that... Like, some of the decisions that felt like they were maybe, like, based off, like... Oh my god. Why didn't I just wait for that to go? Why did it... Why am I so impatient? I'm so impatient, dude. I'm the worst fucking player of all time. I just, like, at a young age, I was like... I, I kind of just was like, I'm not gonna base everything I do off money. Spoken like someone who didn't grow up poor? Uh... Spoken like someone who did grow up poor, you fucking piece of shit. Spoken like someone who didn't have any fucking money, so they realized life was still okay and you could keep doing it. I wasn't gonna sacrifice everything for it. I literally had to go live with a different family because my parents couldn't afford me. What are you talking about? You don't really realize you're... I mean, people don't really realize you don't have much until you, like... Like, I didn't really... Like, it's something like you didn't... Like, I didn't really realize it because I had everything I wanted. I played sports. You know, I was fine. Um, but then like when I got to school, I got to college and I was the only one that had student loans. <laughs> That's when it became really apparent to me. That's when I was like, oh, uh, oh, wait, your parents are going to buy us all groceries. Oh, Mm, yes, whenever I whenever I would go to my lake house, uh, my first Thanksgiving I couldn't go home for Thanksgiving uh, in college, right? I, we didn't have the money. I mean, I didn't have the money to go home, right? So I went to my uh, this guy who lived down the hall from me, and he lived in. I went to University of Colorado, and he's from Aspen. Yeah. Let me just tell you that my world was rocked that weekend my i was just like oh wow this is how the other half live oh man the beer really does flow like wine here I, he was like we he was like yeah so this is our high school and this is our high school chairlift i was like your chairlift he's like yeah we have a chairlift out of the back of our gym and i was like what why, why would you need that he's like oh you know for PE class or like you got free period you can go get some runs in I was like, this is your public high school? Also, this guy, the only guy we've ever kicked out of our fantasy football league, the same guy, because he complained about a $100 buy-in. I just want to point that out. I just want to point that out. I'm sorry. Dude, I went to, he took me to one of his friend's house chat. 
but like, I, so like, I walked in his house and it was like easily the biggest house I'd ever been in. It had like four guest rooms. It was insane. Like, it was an insane house, right? And beautiful area. Everything was beautiful. And he's like, he's like, no, I actually have like one of the smaller houses. And I was like, whatever, whatever. And then he took me to one of his buddy's houses, right? And I'm pretty sure the buddy never sees his parents. But like, this kid's room, bigger than, still to this day, probably the biggest room I've ever been in. They had an indoor Olympic swimming pool chat. They had a golf, indoor golf simulator in the year 2003. They, they had two kitchens. I was like, why do you guys need two kitchens? Why, why do you have two kitchens? Like, well, you know, in case you want to eat over on that side of the house. And I was like, what? Doesn't, it doesn't even make sense. So you guys got to understand, like, I, like, now I've gone a lot over the country, but up at that point, like, I didn't really get to go anywhere, you know, because, I guess. And so my mind was blown about Cholula still, that, like, Cholula hot sauce was still a thing, and there was this great hot sauce that I had just not been eating my whole life. It was, like, a regional thing. And then to walk into there. Fuck! No, uh, my kid's a, my kid's a dick about brushing his teeth, yeah. He's an asshole about it. Riveting gameplay? Hey. Hey, listen. Don't hate the player, hate the game. Yeah, my kid's the slowest kid in his basketball. I mean, I know he's not as slow as he's portraying right now. Like, I know he's he just hasn't learned how to like hit that like next like speed button, you know what I mean? He hasn't learned how to like shift gears. Like he hasn't learned how to sprint yet. He only knows how to jog. Great marathon runner. Average man is taller than- That's not true, I'm average height. Like, exactly average height. Fuck it. Jesus. What does it say? Ends the one. If you include- If you include Asia and children, I'm average height. Average is 5'2"? Dude, I'm way taller than 5'2". Why y'all- Why y'all hate not? What? Jeez. You know what? I'm 5'2", short king, short king for life. You know what? Short, scrawny guys, you know what they do? They sling the dick. Sling it. How about them apples? I don't think Pete Davis is short, but scrawny! Shit. They sure don't reach the high shelf. Dude, I can reach any shelf in my house with minor tooling. <laughs> no, shit! He tied it up. No. I really just die to that shit? Did I just get pawned to death? There's a lot of sports I wish I could have like had access to as a kid. Like if I had access to handball, I might still be playing right now. What if I'm the greatest curler of all time and I've just never gotten to go curling? We didn't have, we didn't have like boys volleyball. What if I was a great setter? And we just don't know it. I what if I'm the Karch Karai of my generation? Come on. Get in there. Get in there. Here's the thing, I was definitely trying to be sponsored by a company like Red Bull <laughs> uh, when I was snowboarding, and I was never gonna get that. I was, I was ass. The guy was like good, 
Like, I'd be, like, good, like, a good, like, best guy in a mountain, but, like, I was never gonna be good, good. Red Bull does have some wild sports they sponsor, though, I will say. Come on. Come in. I hate this game. Sometimes. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Gaming, gaming. Hate the game, but love the song. Uh, because F3 just moved horses. We're not at the spa anymore. Call by me. Nice mini fridge. He gave it to me. I'm trying to go. I fucking hate dark levels, dude. I hate dark levels so much. Dude, anything could hit me at any time. Yeah. Is being stubborn a key trait to being a good speedrunner? I think being stubborn is a key trait in a lot of good and bad things that have happened in my life. Is this the type of thing where if I die, the responsibility gets passed to my next kin? Um... Oh, you're trapped, bitch. Sure. Damn it. Damn it. All pipes lead to death. Everything leads to death. Two old Urza Saga decks that I used to play. To the Detroit speedrun sessions. And I, like, straight up, it was like... Best thing ever. Um, uh, what am I doing here, Matt? I mean, this looks trolly as shit, right? My collection would be insane right now. Yeah, my collection would be really crazy. Estimate this challenge? I think that's pretty obvious. I hope everything's going good, thank God. Good. Yeah, it's like an S for Oh, Jesus Christ. Fuck Henry, thank you for the four months. The corner alt. Am I okay? I'm a little sad. I, I need a new PB chat. SMB2 music, it's so good. Fuck. They stopped making $10,000 bills because it was too easy to take a million bucks out of the country. Yeah, well, I mean, that makes sense, honestly. Fuck, this level's hard. I don't want to die. Yeah, it would have been a lot easier to do a legal business. There is $10,000 bills. Now they just have Bitcoin. We should go after defeating a Lemmy.
Speed of level here. 10k bills are used to pay Twitch streamers nowadays. Nope. We're all direct deposit, dude. Uh, I've seen one check, my very first check I ever got. Twitch. Or no, actually, I take it back. Not my first check, but my first years of check. But then once the checks got like, uh, once the checks started getting like big enough where they were looking at me awkwardly when I deposited them at the bank. I stopped. Yeah, Dagana, thank you for 22 months and I moved to direct deposit. Uh, that equals that. What? What? I didn't understand any of that chat. Yeah, I didn't understand. Now solve for flower. Oh man. Um. I thought that was gonna go differently than it did. I really thought that was gonna go differently than it ended up going. First child's in less than a month. Got any advice for you? Um. I can tell you right now, just the fact that you're asking anyone for advice means you're going to be a great fucking parent. Um, don't worry, your child's not dying, they're breathing. Nine is the level title. Okay. Why didn't I jump? What? <laughs> 